Hello, I'm Jarvis. It's so lazy to update a new video, but today I want to show you it's about audio normalization. This is a very useful function, and we can normalize two different audio. As you can see, what is audio normalization? You can see the left side we have a louder speech, and the right side we have a quieter speech. The louder speech, which means its M2 is more higher, is like there is 0.9, and the right side. You can see the quiet speech is M2 is around like 0.3. So how to normalize these two different audio? We can take a peak and maybe scale it to 0.5. And then this 0.3, we scale it to 0.5. So after this processing, we can see. So we can see these two audio. They have the same height of its M2. They will be more close, and the value is more similar with each other. Let's look at example. So you can see this four figure. As the top two, the original speech one and the original speech two, you can see the speech one is more quieter. It's like the M two is so low, and the right side the speech two is so louder. Its M two is More higher. Okay, let's listen in the MATLAB. You can download the code in the MATLAB website. So if you download my code, you will see the main screen and my function and to demonstrate audio. And you can see this one. So let's just run the main script. First, you can see the speech one. Speech one is the original quiet speech, and let's listen about that. We can type sound and s one, and it's frequency sampling rate. So let's listen. Hello, I'm Jarvis. So this is the first one, and the second one for speech two, we can listen. It is more louder. Hello, I'm Jarvis. Yes, it's a similar with the figure. Left side is more quiet and right side is more louder. So, how to use our function to normalize these two speech? Our function is very simple. Just use a input speech, and we can set a parameters as is. What is our expected peak value? So in this example, you can see now. I use S one. And I set my M max is point five. Be careful about that. This value should supposed to around zero to one between zero to one. This is because of the MATLAB. We always use float or the speech data. So we use point five here. The output is S one output and S two here, and we use the same scale point five as the second parameter, and the S two output is the result. So let's listen about that, and we can see the figure here, like the quiet speech scale and normalize to this one, and the louder speech we can also scale, maybe down scale to this one, and you can see the peak of this speech is point five, and this peak of speech is point five. So we can listen these two speech, and you you will figure out that uh these two the value is very similar. And this is kind of pre-processing for our any audio processing. Okay, thank you for your watching. My next video is about how to read audio by by data. It's like wave data, something like that. And I have uploaded my video in YouTube and the code in MATLAB file exchange and the outline in my own website. Thank you for watching again. See you next time.